The Story of Easter Jesus came into Jerusalem on a, on a lowly donkey. Well, but how did they get the donkey, you may ask? So, he told two of the, two of the twelve disciples to get to get the donkey from like a nearby inn. And the innkeeper was like, what are you going to do with that donkey? Oh, we're just going to return it. We're, we're going to use it for the God, for the Lord. And don't worry, he'll be returned safely. All the people were expecting him to come in on a well-dressed battle horse. And the people waved palms because they were so happy. Everybody um, shouted Hosanna and waved palm leaves and put their cloaks and palm leaves on them. Jesus was sharing the Last Supper with um, his disciples because this was the last time that he would have dinner with them. So that's why it's called the Last Supper. That Jesus broke bread and said, this is my body. And he broke and he poured wine and said, this will be my blood. Uh, so then when they were eating, uh, Jesus said to Judas, go do what you're meant to do. And then Judas left. And then everyone else didn't know what was even going on, you see. So then when they were in the garden, Jesus went to go pray to his father before he died. And then he, he actually, he, when he came back, his disciples were asleep. They couldn't even stay awake. And the guards came and arrested him. And the guards, the guards um, arrested him. Jesus and they tried to defend Jesus and he cut off one of the guards ear but Jesus told him that wasn't the way that they would do it and he healed the guard. So Jesus was like beaten up, spat on so much so that he couldn't even stand up and plus to add that add to the pain he was forced to wear a crown of thorns and a cross on his back and then it really hurt but he knew he could do it. On the hill called Skull I'm going to go with other criminals. What one of the men next to him said, Jesus, forgive me. Before you died on the cross, you told us, um, remember me when I died on the cross. And then the darkness struck, and then he died. Um, Jesus' friends were sad that they, because they would never see their best friend again. And Jesus was crying as well. The curtain in the temple ripped in two. He rolled a huge stone in front of the in front of the tomb and sealed it in place. This was the part where Jesus actually rose from the dead. Angels opened the moved the boulder out of the way and um, lifted him. Um, he then walked out into the into like a forest or a garden, and he saw Mary. And then Mary just thought he was the gardener, but then when he then then he said he was actually Jesus. Madeline danced for joy all the way home. She told the disciples, but they wouldn't believe her. And then. The disciples saw him and then they said, Are you ready? Are you ready? The Jesus and he said, Look at my hands. If they've got if they've got wings on, I'll be half of Jesus. And they he, they did have wings. Then for forty days he travelled across the world and he said, Go spread the word to the Lord before he left into heaven. God beckoned for Jesus to come up to heaven with him and he's gone up, he went up and he has stayed there ever since. The end.